Looking for a new alternative to D&D? Try Fantasy Hero. We're going to go and cover this on today's episode of Fantasy Hero Discussions. Fantasy Hero and Dungeons and Dragons D&D are both popular t- tabletop role-playing games, each with their own unique features and strengths. It's difficult to say objectively which one is better. It often comes to personal preferences and what you're looking for in a role-playing game. There are a few key differences between the two games. First of all, system. Fantasy Hero uses the hero system, which is a point-based system that allows players to create customized characters with a wide range of abilities and skills. While D&D, on the other hand, uses a class and level-based system that provides a more structural approach to character creation. Next, we have character customization. Fantasy Hero provides far more options for character optimization and customization to create exactly what the players want with highly specialized characters. While D&D, on the other hand, provides a limited set of options but is more focused on storytelling and world building. Next, we come into combat. Fantasy Hero has a more tactical and detailed oriented combat system, provides players with a high degree of control over the character's actions. While D&D has a more simpler, fluid combat system that emphasizes on role playing and problem solving. The major difference as well is that, yes, it's mostly D20, but there's several other dice you have to use for mostly damage, while everything is die 6 for the hero system. Finally, we come to setting. D&D has a well-established settings and with rich history and lore with a vi- wide variety of creatures and races, whereas Fantasy Hero has a more open-ended sandbox feel for allowing players to create their own worlds and settings with the, along with the Dungeon Master. Ultimately, the choice between Fantasy Hero and D&D depends on the preferences and playstyle of the players and the GM. Both games have unique experiences and can be enjoyed by players at different levels of experience. But you need to know there's far more different types of games you can play with Fantasy Hero using the Hero system. There are a wide variety of different types of genres that you can explore that's already preset using the hero system while D&D is just that just for fantasy and it doesn't really work well for other genres final thoughts I am a fantasy hero hero system GM so I try to make this as non-biased as possible because it's up to each individual player and GM what they want to run. The great thing about using the system is that it's far more uh, generic and it works well for almost any genre you want to make. And as far as complexity is concerned, you can use what little rules or as much rules as you want. D&D, it's pretty set. There are some optional rules, but not much. So the core system in and of itself, though fluid and seems simplistic, but when it comes to combat and players, they want to use everything, which makes it very complex and harder to do. Also check out my other videos to get more of an overview and how the hero system works. And remember, always be a hero.